Welcome back, babes. I'm super excited to be bringing you video number two for Celebrity Month, and today's celebrity look is Ariana Grande. The look that I'm recreating today is Ariana's staple look. She is known for that gorgeous cat eye liner and a nude lip. Her makeup, I feel like it always brings out her best features. Starting off with a bare face, I'm using the Dr. Brandt Pores No More Primer. If you have large visible pores like I do, this is a great primer to try. For lip conditioner, I'm using my usual Burt's Bees Lip Balm. And as a second primer, I'm using the Milk Blur Stick. I love this product. This blur stick works amazing at really smoothing out your skin and minimizing your pores. This creates such a beautiful, smooth surface on your skin. I love, love using this product before applying foundation. For today's foundation, I'm using the Lorac Perfection Foundation. I feel like I'm only using a lot of products that are specifically for minimizing pores, but hopefully this will give us a beautiful complexion at the end. I really do love this foundation. It has a really nice, beautiful finish, and I'm going a little bit darker in color on my face because I have quite a bit of a tan. For eyeshadow primer, I'm using this one from Wet n Wild, which has also become one of my favorites. This is a really good drugstore buy. And for most of the look today, I'm going to be using this palette from BH Cosmetics. It's the Carly Bible Deluxe Edition palette. I love all the colors in it. Plus, it has these beautiful highlighters as well. So this is all we're going to use. And the first color that I'm starting with is this nude shadow. I'm using this as my base color all over my lid. And then going in with this warm brown tone with that has a hint of orange in it and I'm applying this all over my lid and up to my crease you guys are gonna see this is actually a really really easy eye look to do I'm only using a couple of eyeshadows for it and basically I'm just blending this color all over my eye and you can see I'm using a big blending brush to do it so just up to my crease and out towards my brows then I'm taking the darker brown color from the palette and applying that on my lid. And you can see that I've switched brushes because I want this color to show up a little bit more. So I'm patting that onto my lid up to my crease. Then I'm taking both those same colors again and repeating them for my lower lash line. I don't want this to be too intense. This is very, very subtle shading. So I started off with the light orangey brown going across the lower lash line, and then I used the darker brown just in the outer corner. Next, I took a little bit of that pop of that highlight color, which is really pretty because it has a bit of peach in it, and I used that for the inner corners of my eyes and blended that into the other shadows. And that's it for the eyeshadow look, guys. Super easy. Next, I'm moving on to eyeliner and I'm using the Infallible Paint Eyeliner from L'Oreal. This is a felt tip liner. I like to draw a nice thin line right at the base of my lashes, taking that all the way into the inner corner. And the shape of this line is basically just following my eye shape. Once I have that, then I like to go in and apply my false lashes. So the false lashes that I'm using today are these ones from Ardell. I love, love, love these lashes. And of course, as usual, I'm gonna link everything for you guys down below. To get that perfect Ariana liner, she really loves to extend that wing and have that wing kind of with an upward lift to it. So really lifts the eyes and it's super flattering. What I like to do is to look straight in the mirror and kind of estimate where I want the wing to end. And then I draw a little dot and I draw it on both sides so I make sure that both wings are even. Then once I have that dot, I just use that as my guide and then I just go in and fill the rest of the shape of the wing. I'm using my favorite nude colored liner. This one is from Billion Dollar Brows and I'm using that in my waterline to really open up the eyes and then added a little bit of mascara along the lower lash line. This is one of my favorite ways to give that big doe-eyed effect that Ariana always has. For concealer, I use the Smashbox Studio Skin Concealer and then my Beauty Blender, which is my favorite just for blending it all out. 
And for brows, I'm using two products that I am in love with. These are my go-to staples for the perfect brow. They are both from Maybelline, the Brow Precise Micro Pencil and Fiber Voluminizer. I like to start with the pencil first just to really perfect that shape, mainly at the arch of my brow and the ends. Ariana doesn't really fill in too much at the front of her brow, so I'm gonna keep that part bare. And then I go in with the Fiber Voluminizer just to really fill in the shape and to give them hold. This combo of these two products is my absolute favor for brows right now. Ariana always has beautiful bronzy skin with golden shimmer. Today I'm using the MAC Mineralized Skin Finish Bronzer all over and also this blush from Revlon, which has a very bronzy color to it, so it's perfect for the cheeks. And then for highlighter, I'm using a mix of these two colors from the Carly Bible palette, and I love this combo of all these products together. I think it just makes the skin look so beautiful, and I'm highlighting in all the key areas, above the cheekbone, down the bridge of my nose, and the cupid's bow. I'm using these gorgeous colors from Rimmel London. The first one is called Be My Baby. This is part of their new Stay Matte collection. They're all liquid lipsticks. I love them. And what I'm doing is I'm applying the color first and then I'm going in with a lip liner from Bare Minerals to line my lips. So I like to do this because I feel you can get a really diffused look when you do. This color is called Freestyle and it matches with this lip color perfectly. Then I'm going in with the second Stay Matte Liquid Lipstick from Rimmel London. This one is called Mocha, and I'm using that mainly in the center of my lip. The calm of these three products gives that perfect matte nude that Ariana always has. This is one of my favorite looks to do because I think this cat eye liner is so flattering and it can really change the shape of your eyes. Let me know what you guys think of this Ariana look. I hope you guys love it and be sure to add me on Instagram as well because I usually post a little bit of behind the scenes right after I film a video so you guys could see it right away before it even goes live. And if you haven't seen my first celebrity look for this month, my Selena Gomez look, you can click right here. Make sure you subscribe if you're new for for a lot more videos and hit that like button if you like celebrity month and i will see you guys in another video very soon